Azrael, Biblical Hebrew, Zerl is an angel in the Abrahamic religions. He is often identified with the Angel of Destruction and Renewal of the Hebrew Bible. The Hebrew name translates to Angel of God, Help from God, or One Whom God Helps. Azrael is the spelling of the Chambers Dictionary. The Quran refers to Azrael as Malaku Almati, Malik al Mat, Angel of the Dead which corresponds with Hebrew term Malik HaMavid in rabbinic literature. Islamic Arabic tradition adopts the name, in the Arabic language as Azr il Arabic. He is responsible for transporting the souls of the deceased after death. Background <inaudible> 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 Depending on the outlook and precepts of various religions in which he is a figure, Azrael may be portrayed as residing in the third heaven. In one description, he has four faces and four thousand wings, and his whole body consists of eyes and tongues whose number corresponds to the number of people inhabiting the earth. He is recording and erasing constantly in a large book the names of men at birth and death, respectively. In Judaism In Judaism, Azrael is identified as the angel of death. However, the name, Azrael, itself is rarely used in Hebrew lore. In Jewish mysticism, he is commonly referred to as, Azrael, not, Azrael. The Zohar, a holy book of the Jewish mystical tradition of Kabbalah, presents a positive depiction of Azrael. The Zohar says that Azrael receives the prayers of faithful people when they reach heaven, and also commands legions of heavenly angels. Accordingly, Azrael is associated with the South and is considered to be a high-ranking commander of God's angels Zohar 2 -202b. In Christianity There is no reference to Azrael in the Christian Bible, and as such Azrael is regarded as neither a canonical nor non-canonical figure in Christianity. In the apocryphal book of 2 Esdras, however, a story features a scribe and judge named Ezra, sometimes written, Azra, in different languages. Azra was visited by the archangel Uriel and given a list of laws and punishments he was to adhere to and enforce as judge over his people. Azra was later recorded in the apocrypha as having entered heaven, without tasting death's taint. Depending on various Christian religious views, it could be taken as Ezra ascending to angelic status. This would add the suffix el to his name, which denotes a heavenly being, e.g., Michael, Raphael, Uriel. Hence, it would be Ezrael, Azrael. Later books also state a scribe named Salathiel, who was quoted as saying, I, Salathiel, who is also Ezra. Again, depending on certain views of Christian spirituality, this could be seen as angelic influence from Ezrael, Azrael on Salathiel. Although there is no angel of death in the Christian Bible, some Coptic sources name this angel, Muriel. This text, Discourse of the Abashan, a sermon based on the text delivered by Timothy the Archbishop of Alexandria in 386, claims that God changed his name to Abashan. However, this is not commonly accepted by most mainline Protestant or Catholic churches. According to this document, depending on whether you have done good works or not while on earth, you will be visited by Abashan in one of two forms. Either the calm and peaceful man with a likeness to Adam or as a seven-headed monster to scare the soul of the unbeliever and filthy to a literal death on his or her deathbed. Topic in Islam along with Jibrail, Mikhail and Israfil, the angel of death, called Azrael Zerail is one of the archangels of the Islamic faith. He and his subordinate angels are responsible for taking the souls of the deceased away from the body. Azrael does not act independently from God, he takes only those souls which he has been commanded to take. Rather than merely representing an independent personified death, Azrael is described in Islamic sources as subordinate to the will of God with the most profound reverence. In one tradition, death and Azrael were once two separate entities, although in Islamic traditions, the lines between death personified and Azrael are blurred. Accordingly, God created death, and entrusted Azrael to him. The Kitab Awal al Qiyamah offers a detailed account of death and its relation to Azrael. Several Muslim traditions recount meetings between the Angel of Death and the Prophets, the most famous being a conversation between the Angel of Death and Moses. In an Islamic narration, the Prophet Idris befriended the Angel Azrael. 
Idris offered him food, whereupon Azrael revealed to Idris his non-human essence because as an angel, he does not eat. Later the archangel showed him the heavens. See also Angels in Islam Death personification. List of angels in theology Punishment of the grave Serial Thanatos, the personification of death in Greek mythology Topic. References Topic. External links Media related to Azrael at Wikimedia Commons